right, it's your star family fortunes. Tonight, it's a star from McFly against the sweet factory owner from Emmerdale, a man who makes rock against a man who makes rock. <laughs> <laughs> so far, the Judds have 74, but in the league with 137, it's the Bissons. <laughs> Now, don't worry, Harry and the Judd family. You've got 74, the Bissons have got 137. All that could change now because we're about to up the ante. We're going to play double money. <laughs> yes! What does double money mean, Harry? It means you double your money. Yes, Harry! <laughs> so if I've got a pound and you double it, you're going to get two. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Not just a pity face. Not just a man who keeps the rhythm, <laughs> but they've got brains as well. All right, Kieran and Thomas, come and join me as we play Double Money! <laughs> Here and Thomas, Thomas, Kieran. Smart, pristine, ironed. No excuse, good luck. <laughs> one hand behind your buzzer, Fair one enough. hand behind your back. Here we go, it's double money, pivotal point of the game. Every point's worth twice the price. We surveyed 100 people looking for the top five answers. Name an animal you might see on safari. Oh. A lion. <laughs> <laughs> a lion. Let's have a look. Our survey says... Top yes. answer. Eamon, looking for uh, four more answers. Name an animal you might see on safari. A giraffe, Vernon. Why do giraffes have long necks? Because the head is so far away from the body. No, it's because they've got smelly feet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's have a look. Giraffe, our survey says... <laughs> yes! <laughs> well done. Well done. Chris, what do you think? I'm going to go for a zebra. A zebra? Yes. Do you know uh, no zebra looks alike? No. It's not a joke, it's a fact. Oh, right. <laughs> yeah, they're all individuals. <laughs> all right, here we go. Zebra, our survey says... <laughs> yes! You're doing really well. You're doing really well, Laura. Let's see if we can keep the ball rolling, because we only need two more answers for a full board and the first round of double money will be yours. What do you think? Tiger. Ooh. <laughs> yes, like that. Like that, tiger. Let's have a see. Our survey says... <laughs> yes! <laughs> the fifth most popular answer. We're still struggling to find the second most popular answer. What do you think, Nicole? Elephant. Elephant. <laughs> yes! Elephant! <laughs> If it's there, you've got a full board without losing any lives, which is amazing, I'll be honest with you. But is it up there? Let's have a look. Our survey says... <laughs> yeah! <laughs> well done, Nicole. Well done, the Bissons. Excellent stuff. That never happens on this show. <laughs> it never happens, people getting a full board without losing any lives, especially if you're on that team. <laughs> <laughs> so, well done. At the end of the first double money round, the scores are the judge of 74, but in the lead with 319, it's the Bissons. <laughs> All right, let's welcome our fifth family members, Eamon and Ben, for the final round of double money. Ben, Eamon, Eamon, Ben, two big men. All right, one hand behind your bus, one hand behind your back. Good luck to you both. It's the final round, double money. Surveyed 100 people looking for the top five answers. Name a way to tell the time if you've not got a watch. Eamon. Sundial. Sundial. Do you have a sundial in your back garden? Yes. Do you use it? We haven't got one, really. <laughs> 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 Cheeky scamp. Got to get away with having a sundial. <laughs> uh, all right, you say sundial. Our survey says <laughs> yes. Oh, it's there. Right. Sundial. Right. So, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. It's only the third most popular answer. The big fella here might find an answer that's higher up the board. What do you think, Ben? Uh, I'm going to go mobile phone. A mobile phone. If you didn't have a watch, just get your phone out and have a look at the time. Uh, survey says <laughs> yes. Oh. 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 Do you want to play off past me, fella? Pass the skipper. Right, you're going to play. Right. All right, yeah. Emma, back to your family starts with food, you might get the chance to steal. <laughs> nice one, me. Before you give me your answer, Harry. Yes. How long have you been in McFly? I think it's eight years now. Eight years now. Yes. Um, Over eight years. Over and, eight years. Uh, how many top ten singles have you had? Um, have you had? 12 to 15, I think. Let's call it 15, because it's more uh, than 12. Yeah. Right, Let's go with 20. Let's go with 20. Yeah, why not? Why not? And you've sold millions of records worldwide. Yeah. 
And uh, you're a big fan of music yourself. Indeed. How long have you been drumming all your life? Uh, no, only since I was about 15, so about just over 10 years, yeah. Right. What kind of music do you actually like? Um, I like all sorts, pop music and rock music generally. Yeah, we know that because I've got your MP3 player here. <laughs> right. <laughs> so what I did, I, I went through oh, it. Oh, mate. Yeah. <laughs> and you've got to remember that the reputation of drummers is that they're like the wacky, crazy, bonkers ones. You know what I mean? Keith Moon. Yeah. Your man from Led Zeppelin. John Bonham. Yeah. Phil Collins. <laughs> <laughs> so I had, a, I, had a, I had a skip through, you know, as you do on these MP3 players. Just, just listen to this when I press play, right? <laughs> the tune, great tune. The tune, yeah! <laughs> Everyone loves ABBA. They're amazing. Keith Moon was still alive. There's no way that he'd had ABBA. He was a big ABBA fan, him. Keith Moon. Was he? Yeah, big ABBA fan. <laughs> 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 Here's another one of Harry's tunes on his MP3 player. He ever played that to you in the dark? <laughs> <laughs> he yeah, has to me. <laughs> I knew those drummers were crazy for a reason. <laughs> All right, there's another one I want you to hear. Listen to this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Jeez. Yeah, love it. All right, stop, stop, stop. Now, I'll be honest with you. I'm, yeah. I'm joking with you. I think those are three cracking tunes. Great tunes. But you've got some proper garbage on there. Listen to this. <laughs> uh, but there you go, that, that's uh, an insight into Harry's... Harry's Thank you and for that, Vernon. Yeah, no Thank worries, you. Abba. Here we go. <laughs> right. Name a way to tell the time if you've not got a watch. Look at the clock. Look at the clock. Mamma oh, mia. <laughs> Look at the clock. Our survey says. <laughs> oh. Who do you ask? Who do you ask? Exactly! <laughs> Name the way to tell the time if you've not got a watch, Izzy. Ask someone. Oh. Yeah! Brains oh. <laughs> as well as beauty. She's a class act. She's Jeez. a keeper. Aww. All right, here we go. Ask someone. Our survey says. Oh, there you go. Yes, Izzy. Good job. Good job. Well done. You've got two answers remaining. You've got two lives left, Emma. So oh. we're doing all right. So, Emma, name a way to tell the time if you've not got a watch. Yeah, I'd say news, because I know at 6 o'clock it's the news, or, the, the, or 8 o'clock it's the and news. And then you wouldn't need to know the time, because the news is on, so it must be 6 or 10. Yes, exactly. Yes, <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, here we go. The news, our survey says... <laughs> oh! Emma! Oh. So wanted it to be there, Emma. Yep. Thomas. Listen to the radio. Listen to the radio. Right. Ooh. Listen to the radio. It's crunch time, because if it's not there, we're going to go over to the business. They will get the chance to steal if they can come up with an answer. Listen to the radio. Our survey says... Oh. Oh. Emma, what do you think? Um, kitchen appliance. Kitchen appliance. Kieran. Computer. Computer. Nikwa. TV. Laura. Oven. Question. <laughs> 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 Chris, you can have one of them well, or one of I, your own. I do like a computer, which Kieran said. But yeah. I think you look at the cooker or the microwave or a kitchen appliance, don't you? Kitchen appliance, yeah. yeah. Collectively, they're kitchen appliances. That's what we'll go for. So we're going to go for. Yeah. All right, if it's not their Judd family, we're going to give you the points. All right, good luck. Let's have a look. Kitchen appliance. So, survey says. Ah, oh, there you go. There you go. There you go. Let's quickly just ask Ben what we're going to say at the end there, Ben. Oh, I was going to say computer. Computer? Yeah. All right, so the fifth most popular answer was. Yes! <laughs> yes! Just and the fourth most popular answer was? Computer. Speaking. Oh, 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 of course. 
of course, there you go. Right, so at the end of the main game, the Judds have 252 points, but the winners start with 319 points. It's the Bisson! <laughs> so, Bisson family, you're going to be playing our Big Money final in just a moment, but unfortunately, we have to say goodbye to quite possibly the most beautiful-looking family we've had on Family Fortunes, oh. except for Thomas. <laughs> <laughs> You're drilling here. Come know, on, stop. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no, you have been a fantastic family. You've been great sports. You really, really have. Harry, Thanks for it's having always us. a pleasure, Thank my you friend. Much. You're a star. You really are. <laughs> well, you know what? Nobody leaves empty-handed. Yeah. You've got 252 points, which we're going to multiply by 10, so we'll give you 2,000. Five hundred and twenty pounds for your charity, yeah, and amazing. it's a charity that's really close yeah. to both yes. you and Izzy's heart. Yeah. Just to explain what it is again, Harry. Well, Izzy can take over here. Well, I just, I just like to say, Eyes of Light is um, for people who are tragically going through long-term brain injury rehabilitation, like my brother. And two thousand, my ma math is rubbish. Five hundred and twenty will give so many days and so many wishes, and we've just had the most lovely day. So thank you. Oh, brilliant! Thank you so much. much. Yeah. You know what? So my love to the boys. Lovely. And let's not forget, Emma, you picked up that fantastic oh, golf no. breakaway. Oh, you are going to enjoy wow, that. Try and get a holy one. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> All you've got to do is yes. follow through. Yes. <laughs> yes. Yeah. You've been great sports. Give them a massive round of applause. The wonderful Judd family. <laughs> so, Chris, well done. Well done. Uh, Chris, you're going to go forward. Uh, after the break, we're going to play our big money final. You can't do it on your own. You need a teammate. Who are you mm -hmm. going to play with? 